Hi, Carissa Cloutier here, better known as the Darling Hat Diva, and I'm sitting here reflecting on my teaching experiences, and one of the things that came to mind was the fact that I had to repeat things several times. Now, as a mom, we have to do that. We have to repeat directions over and over, and we find ourselves doing that all the time. That doesn't really end, but um, I'm more talking about very simple instructions, very simple things to do, uh, and what what dawned on me throughout my years of teaching was that a lot of parents don't talk to their kids. You know, they send them home, they sit them in front of the television, and it's understandable because we're all tired when we get home from work or whatever we do during the day um, to have to then be on the clock, so to speak, with our kids is very difficult to do. But I can't stress to you the importance of speaking with your child on a daily basis. And I'm not talking about just making sure you talk to him, hey, how you doing? But I'm also talking about having some deep in thought conversations. You know, one of the first things that I do with my child is ask her how her day was. Now, she's very much like her father. They are not detail oriented. I will tell a story and go on and on about it. And they are very cut to the chase, get to the point. Great, good, one answer. You know, but um, that it also means that you have to listen when they're ready to talk. You know, my daughter's now 12, and the times that she wants to speak is very few now. But when she does, when she's in that mood to share with me, I am there to listen. And I'm there to offer my opinions if she wants it, because you have to listen to them and develop that communication skills. So many kids today lack communication skills. They are having problems communicating with other people and other adults. And some of that we can attribute to the internet, you know, with um, texting, with chatting. And so the need to communicate face to face has, has gone down in our society. But it's so important because those students, those kids that learn how to effectively communicate, they become the leaders, they become the managers, they become the presidents because they're able to communicate and work with other people very well. So I just encourage you as parents, as moms, to make sure you're talking to your kids and having in-depth conversations with them on a daily basis. And when your child is ready to talk, be the ear and be there ready to listen. So I hope that helps someone out, out there. And with that, that's all I have for today. Stay classy. We'll see you next time.